The Seaguard in Bollock Prevention System is a novel micro-net covered carotid stent designed to treat the stenotic disease in the cervical carotid artery, improving patient safety through sustained embolic protection. The stent is made up of nitinol struts spaced 3 mm apart and joined together at various points on the circumference. Seaguard is an open sill stent covered by a polyethylene terephthalate or PET micro mesh sleeve sutured to both ends of the stent. The micronet has an average pore size of 150 to 180 micron and is designed to prevent embolization during and post procedure. The stent X ray visibility is good as the stent is highly radiopaque. As per the Instruction for Use Manual, conduct the following steps to prepare the Seaguard Embolic Prevention Stent System. Ensure that the hemostatic valve position matches the chosen stent size in accordance with the measurement marks on the handle. For device flushing, use a 3 cubic centimeter lure lock syringe filled with heparinized saline solution. Carefully flush the system. Hold the Y-valve body, connect the syringe, and hold the syringe properly for flushing. Avoid advancing the Y-connector distally during flushing. Maintain positive pressure until saline drops are observed exiting the Seaguard EPS at the distal end. This can take up to 30 seconds. Ensure saline is observed both at the distal end as well as at the RX guide wire port. Verify that the Y-valve remains in its initial mark and disconnect the syringe. Introduce and advance the stent through the lesion. Once the stent is positioned in the stenosis, conduct the following steps to deploy the Seaguard Embolic Prevention Stent System. Hold the handle firmly with one hand while unlocking the hemostatic valve with the other hand, rotating the wheel in counterclockwise. Check that the hemostatic valve remains in its initial mark position. Ensure the hemostatic Y valve of the introducing sheath is open to guarantee freedom of movement of the delivery system's outer sheath during deployment. Ensure optimal positioning of the stent prior to deployment. After verifying stent positioning, keep the handle system in a fixed position avoiding displacement. Deploy the stent by holding the hemostatic valve body and slowly pull it back within the handle. Note that it may take a few seconds for the deployment to start. Continue to pull back until the hemostatic valve has reached the end of the handle and the stent is fully deployed. Seaguard does not elongate or foreshorten, hence the proximal and distal ends will open at the intended location. Following deployment of the stent, post-implant dilatation is recommended with a 5 mm balloon in order for the PET mesh to fully deploy and provide optimal long-term embolic protection. The Seaguard carotid stent is manufactured in diameters from 6 to 10 mm and lengths from 20 to 60 mm, requiring for access a 6 French long sheath or an 8 French guiding catheter. Seaguard, embolic protection that lasts.